There is a lot of chit chat about the Campiflegri uh, super volcano. Super volcano, there is no scientific definition of it. There is a lot of volcanoes around the world. A few of them are out of the Ring of Fire. And this one in the uh, Italy is supposed to cause a disaster. You see several craters around it. But what we are talking about is a big caldera. And anybody who believes that this caldera is actually a super volcano, it, I, I don't know what to say. It doesn't know anything about geology. Volcanoes form when there is a subduction in this setting, of course. And the distance and the geometry of the subduction determines how far away from the subduction zone you will have the volcano. So in this case, we have the Africa undergoing subduction under the Eurasian plate and creating these uh, volcanoes dotted all over the place. There is a magma chamber under it. This magma chamber is feeding the volcanoes around above it. But it doesn't mean that the whole area is a super volcano. It means the magma chamber is very big and flat. We have terms for it uh, in geological terms. Uh, those nothing to do with the being, uh, you know, eruptive sequence. You just have something that is inflates. Then when deflates, you will see this kind of... Uh, caldera-shaped structures around it. Most of what you see is American jingoism, unfortunately. And unfortunately, this is leading, you know, to some belief in the people. American way of life, it seems, that believes that every weekend for the Monday, the world must end because nobody wants to go to work. So they have this apocalyptic uh, waiting all the time for them to happen. They wish something to happen, probably finish their misery of the life. I don't understand this. There is no super volcano here. Every now and then this kind of news comes and uh, people try to actually popularize this. This is from 2019. You see, they were telling exactly the same thing and it didn't happen, as we know.